Friday. <laughs> Thank God it's Friday. And it's the first day of spring. Oh, I can't believe it. Yes, I know. I'm Ricky Shees. What is up, everyone? Again, happy Friday. I'm Megan Tellis. The ladies are back together once Yay. again. I'm Dao Vu. Yeah. Today, the owner of Rayo's Restaurant, Frank Pellegrino Jr., joins us at the round table. Thank yes. you so much for joining yes. us, Fred. Pleasure to be here with you. I've been to your restaurant. It's fantastic. How do you describe it to people who have not been there? Well, quite frankly, it's like walking into my family's dining room at home. Um, it's a place where your shoulders don't go up, but you breathe a sigh of relief, you relax. Ah. Um, it's turn of the century. The restaurant was founded in 1896 mm -hmm. in New York in East Harlem, and it is still there to this day. And I go back quite frequently, actually every month, Most to visit. Most people can't get a seat in New York, but they can sure get a seat here in Vegas. How yeah. long is the wait list? Uh, in New York, Forever. I can't even get a table. <laughs> Bill Clinton, I, Bill Clinton years? couldn't even get a, ta a table. Well, b Mr. Clinton, former <laughs> President Bill Clinton, gets in whenever he calls. Oh, that's um, good. For the most part, I'm going to get in trouble for that. <laughs> yeah, that's But anyhow, um, here in Las Vegas, the book is open. In New York, on the other hand, um, I really only get to eat there when I work there, and the book opens once a year, and there's very limited space. And now the reason for that is twofold. There, there's only ten tables in the restaurant in New uh, York City, mm -hmm. and the guests who frequent the restaurant have been dining with us for decades, if not, wow. I Since think. Since the 1800s? <laughs> <laughs> no, I wish. Just kidding. Um, well, so what happens? I mean, the people who've been signing up for all these years, yeah. they, do they pass it down to their kids? Believe or? it or not, yeah. it uh, has been, uh, reservations have been part of wills and estates wow. and divorce settlements, too. <laughs> Believe it or oh, not. Interesting. Wait, yeah. but like, what is in the food? Is there gold sprinkles? Like, what what is it the about your restaurant? The magic ingredient in in all of the food that we prepare is the most important ingredient, which is love. I mean, wow. we genuinely care about every facet of our execution. Our chefs in Las Vegas, Chef Fatima, who's with us here today, back there. Hi, Chef. Hi, <laughs> Chef. Hi, Chef. <laughs> our chef in Los Angeles, Jay, and Chef Dino in New York, who heads up the team, really. Um, they cook with passion, they cook with their heart, and they cook with love because our guests' happiness is our success, quite now, frankly. Now, what's the difference between, this? you've got one in L.A. here at Caesars Palace and one the, the grandfather of them all in New York. What are the, the difference between the mm -hmm. crowds? You say, so you've got generations of people who, you know, have just grown up with it in New York, but how does that compare to Las Vegas? Um, Las Vegas is... Uh, far more eclectic, and that's due to the fact that it's uh, a town that many, city that many people visit, um, as opposed to um, being here regularly. So the mix of clientele ranges um, far more. There's a lot more variety and diversity than in New York. Um, however, New York is a very vibrant clientele and, and guest list that um, I, I really don't speak about that often because it again too is an eclectic mix of people and a coming together of people from all different walks of lives sure. from the local mailman all the way up to titans of business and what have you and politicians yeah. and government officials such as President Clinton and some <laughs> others, <laughs> Senator, uh, Secretary of State John Kerry. Um, Los Angeles is a very interesting scene it's very reminiscent of New York because the restaurant is much smaller than what's here in Las Vegas. And the vibe there is, uh, is, is cool. It's cool Cali. It's mellow and yeah. uh, it's a lot of fun. There's great music. The food is terrific. I think Kevin and the service, you know, our team makes you, our family makes you feel like you're part of the family. Yeah. So, well, we're so happy that you're joining us today. We can't wait to taste your ravioli. Are you ready to get to our trending topics? Absolutely. Yeah, let's, let's 